Amanda, thank you. We'll see you in a bit. After some recent shark sightings off the coast of Maine, fears are circulating. A lot of people want to know, is this one shark or are there multiple? And are the sightings increasing? Our Pearl Small was in Scarborough today speaking with marine officials, has a few answers for us. Yep. Darian Granada says his phone hasn't stopped ringing all morning. We've had some reports. We've had some video sent to us from, from a few people. As the harbor master and marine resource officer for the town of Scarborough, people are looking to him for information about shark sightings over the weekend. There's been a few sightings of we, what we think is the same animal. Based off information the Department of Marine Resources has given them, they believe it was the same shark. They confirm it is about seven to eight feet long and is a great white shark primarily swimming around the same area. They see him now because more people are getting out on the water. Granada says it was seen once in Biddeford about a week ago, but was mostly spotted near Pine Point and the Richmond Harbor Island area. Despite concerns, he doesn't think this is anything out of the ordinary. Um, I think that we're seeing more because there's more people paddling. There's more people with you know cell phones and uh, social media getting it out there. He says the shark is in its natural habitat, away from shallow waters, and there's no reason to believe it should be dangerous. We're just trying to make sure that everybody has situational awareness that it is out there. And <laughs> that doesn't make me feel good no matter what. <laughs> At the beach on Tuesday, Laura Daly says just knowing it's in her area makes her want to steer clear of the water. A paddleboarder saw the shark. I was like, we were going to be on the paddle boards. I saw a lot of people paddle boarding yesterday. So you just never know, I guess. Haley says they tuck their paddle boards away, just in case. Actions not everyone feels the urge to take. No, it's not something I think about. Jesse Pappenberg says he always remembers how uncommon shark attacks are. The odds of being killed by one are one in 4.3 million, according to the International Shark Attack File. I think awareness is important, but again, I don't feel that unprovoked shark attacks are a significant danger. And if you do come across the shark, Granada says there are ways to avoid putting yourself in danger. Yeah, we recommend that they continue upon their way on, the, on their boat, leave the animal alone, and let it, let it do its thing. It's, it's in its natural habitat. In Scarborough, Pearl Small, News Center, Maine.